Hi my friends, how are you guys doing? Today I'm going to introduce you guys to another fun gadget. My previous one was on drawing, today is on music. So this is the foldable soft keyboard piano. Alright, let's take a look at its design. So in front of me is the 61 key soft keyboard piano. And my table is not big enough, but let me show you. It extend to the end here, all right. And then uh, this is the control panel where you can change the rhythm and then uh, change the tone. And I'll explain to you guys later. So basically, this is a foldable, foldable keyboard, all right. It's very thin, and the beneath it is the rubber mat, all right. This is to hold the keyboard so that it will not slip. Okay. Okay, let's take a look at how sensitive this keyboard is. All right, you can cannot just uh, pat on the keyboard. It will not work. You need to press. All right, add a little bit of pressure. And for this black key, uh, it's a little bit thicker. So you need to apply uh, much more pressure. Alright, something like this. And almost the whole area of the keys can be used. Alright, for example, see? Okay. Here, cannot. Here, cannot. Alright, other part should be okay. Let's take a look at the control panel. So basically, this is the small control panel over here, and this is for output, for speaker, this is for headphone, and this is for input of a DC 6 volt, and there's a, a cable provided here. So you need to use the appropriate adapter, alright? So this is the on-off button, and then this is the start-stop, plus-minus, and you can change the rhythm or the tone. From the menu, there's a tone list which indicate uh, by those numbers. All right, there's a total of uh, 127 tone you can change. All right, it's over here. And for the rhythm, uh, there's also about um, 127 rhythm. And there's a list of demo song. Uh, it's about 30 demo song. So basically this is the speaker and this is the volume knob and this is the tone button. Say you need to change the tone. Just press once, alright? And you can press the plus or minus sign. So when you plus it, you uh, increase the number. So according to the manual list, you can choose your own tone, alright? For example, so you want to change again, 29, 31, 32, alright, this is how it works. So for the rhythm, let's say you need some uh, rhythm to accompany your playing, just press rhythm and you can choose from the number over here and you need to press the start, alright, uh, the sound volume is not really that good. Therefore, I'm using my Zelog S32 speaker to pump up the volume, alright? Just need to plug in from here. Alright, you can hear the difference. My Zelog S32, I've made a video out of this. You guys can watch it if you haven't done so. Alright, let's say you want to change the rhythm again. Um, you just press rhythm and press the plus minus. And you can select your desired rhythm. After which, you just leave it if you think it is okay. Alright, it's simple. If you want to stop, just press the stop. It will stop. Alright. Another feature is that you can use to record what you have played. Just press the record. And then uh, you can just play a song, for example. Then you can uh, play back. 
all right to see if uh, it sounds good and once you do one uh, you can go back by pressing the record again you go back to normal all right so you can use the piano again but you can't uh, use back what you have recorded just now it's only temporary and there's this demo button which once you press it there's a list of uh, 30 demo songs for you all right and then lastly is the on off button let's say you don't want to play it and you just press it all right you off it simple and this is the battery compartment behind all right you need a four time double a battery all right lastly let me show you this all right you can do this on the white key but not the black key right it won't work because it's, it's a little bit thicker over here so you need to press all right so if you press down six key like a chord all right it really works and this is how portable it is 16 by 5 when it is folded up so it is very portable and you can carry it anywhere and um, it's very convenient all right and in my next video i will either review this uh, amaze fit this watch smartwatch or this budget smartwatch but with uh, earbuds hiding inside all right so we'll see you in the next video and take care everyone. Bye.